second and three. He's got another Darcy. Over the seam. Caught. Regaini. And brought down inside the five by Sterling Weatherford. 45-yard pickup. For the slot here to get open. He's a Connecticut kid. Young does a nice job to get open right there. Gets it all the way down inside the five-yard line. Watch this little move. Yeah. Makes it second down and four. Stanley taking a shot down the field. Smith by set open. Touchdown, Hawkeyes. 58 yards. Nate Stanley has tied Ricky Stanzi for third in school history. 7 0, Iowa. Season to prepare. Goodson in. Stanley throws wide open as Tracy. Tracy makes a cut. Tracy still on his feet. Across the 25, down to the 23. Just a simple over route into a zone coverage. But what's special is what he does after he catches the ball. Turns it around. Jeez, there's six red helmets. He's going to get paid a lot. Hand off to Torn Young. Has a big hole. Stays on his feet. Torn Young. Tackled at the 24-yard line, a 32-yard run. These Iowa backs are showing up in this game. How about nice, that lead nice block. little hug. Oh, you gotta love it, Brady Ross. Make makes the man miss. Tyshawn Fogg. Was that ooh? Make Tyshawn Fogg miss. <laughs> was able to, was able to get down the field. Shirt senior render having a breakout year. On second and a mile, Stanley to air it out. He's got Smith Marset, who makes a terrific over the shoulder catch. What a grab. What a grab. The corner to that side, who is starting his first game of the season. It was after a Middle Tennessee drive to start this second. He's outgaining the Blue Raiders single handedly. And he will hand it off here to Torin Young. Torin Young in the middle Tennessee territory. And he is finally wrestled down. Javante Moffitt was hanging on for about 10 yards. Inside the 30, a run of 52. Known for his speed, but the hole was so big that he was just un it was uncontested. Khalil Brooks, he swings and misses. Then it turns into a foot race. And you're right, if Moffitt's not back. Richard Freshman using the hard count. Goodson again. Tyler Goodson was knocked out of bounds. No, he was not. He got the end zone. He's in there at the pylon for a touchdown, and his Iowa teammates are going to mob him. Not sure if the right foot went out of bounds or not. Oh, he He's just out the heel. His heel is at the eight-yard line. Stanley will throw it down the field. He's got a receiver. Up and caught at the 44-yard line. What a throw and what a grab. What an incredible job by Brandon Smith to use his body like we saw Nico Collins from Michigan do earlier. He bodies up number 24, Lavert Hill, and he's able to come down with the ball. Great throw from Nate Stanley. Brandon Smith, who stands 6-2 over Lavert Hill, who's 5-11. And the win goes to the Iowa Hawkeyes on a huge conversion. There's a sandbagging 18 handicap was this guy's report. <laughs> Here's Stanley throwing day for an open receiver. Smith Marset. Dragged down inside the five. Not how they drew it up, but it was effective for Iowa. Now Stanley throwing it up for grabs. Wow, and it is here. Oh! What a catch by Brandon Smith. Just ask the question, who's going to make a play for Nate Stanley? Brandon Smith says, I will. Thank you very much. A state champion high jumper in high school. He jumps over John Reed for the touchdown catch here to keep Iowa very much alive in the ballgame. They're going to go for a very important two-point play. Smith, excellent size, 6'2", 218. Todd mentioned the athleticism. Second and four for 
Stanley. He'll try and put one over the top. And on the money in the one-handed grab by Amir Smith Marset. And the dance moves down the sideline. Watch this pass. Stanley drops it in. Watch this catch, folks. One-handed. Presses it out. The DB, one of their best corners, Corey Trice, didn't even see the football. Great timing on the throw. Excellent catch. Big-time play for Iowa. And with that throw... Sends it downfield and help him out is Brandon Smith. Got away from a couple of defenders to make the catch and a gain of 30. The throw and watch, he's looking at him right here, comes off of it, and now you just got to hit him number 12. Smith just goes to the sideline. Nice catch, good concentration. Those are tough ball to catch and throw when you're off balance like that. It's a nice connection, huge play. It's an explosive. Stanley making his 34th consecutive start today. Clean pocket, steps up, guns it, passes, caught, that'll move the six. Tyrone Tracy, there he goes, Tracy, towards the end zone for the Iowa touchdown. Back against that zone defense and runs a curl route, and then it's poor tackling. A good job by Stanley keeping the safety in the middle of the field, waiting for the receiver Tracy to come back for the football, and, and then just miss tackles. And, Northwestern told us this yesterday. Love fullbacks, and we rarely see fullbacks show up on depth charts anywhere around the country. Play action, nifty handwork that time by Stanley. Looking for his tight end, Laporta grabs it this time. Sam Laporta tripped up short of midfield, and big number 84 rumbles for a first down. We actually have a flag laid, but Laporta goes up and snatches this one. The play action pass with the veteran quarterback you can afford to do that third and 12. Cone out of the pocket. Got him. That one's a free ball. That's a live one and Iowa's got it at the 16 yard line. Literally taken out of his hand. Cedric Lattimore has the recovery. Epinesa knocked it free. Outside it makes it tough for a big lineman to try to affect him but he not only closes that gap he gets there fast enough was able to get that hand on the ball and chops it down before there's forward progress. We told you at the top of the show he's going to be the guy that's going to affect this defense in a significant way. Done with that Illini. Well they've beaten Whiskey too and they did it with a late interception. Over the middle. There Tracy! Is. Tyrone <laughs> Tracy won't be stopped. Touchdown. How can you beat the coverage on the outside? You can see because the safety's up, that inside slant route was going to be there every single time. It was about when Brian Ferentz was going to see it and take advantage of it. Well, I'm telling you what, he dialed up something sweet right there. That was impressive. Kramer lost him down the field. Jump ball! And it's picked off by Riley Moss. Not about that. It's an Iowa team that's a little different than in years past. They don't run the ball as much. And pressure right up the gut. Stanley able to break away from Daley Harvey. Throw it on the run down the sideline. And it's caught inside the 15 by Amir Smith-Marset. The strength of Stanley to break free. Dean for 40 yards. It's a BTN standout presented by Auto Owners Insurance. And if that's not Ben Roethlisberger, nobody is. That's what I was talking about, Kevin. He has that ability. He's got those... Big old hands to make big old throws. Here's Goodson again. And the give to Smith Marset. He's got Stanley out front as a blocker. He may not need him. Smith Marset down the sideline. One man to beat. Dives for the pylon. And it is a touchdown. The funniest part here is watch Nate Stanley. He's going to run the best 40 he's ever run in his life right here. And he just watched him run right past him. Smith Marset can scoot. There's Goodson with an opening. And Goodson hopping over a tackler and turning on the Jets. Goodson down the sidelines into the end zone for an Iowa touchdown. They did a nice job on that on that defensive front. And he got to the second level and just hit another gear. Once he hit that gear, you can see the what a good job of, of blocking up front. And then cut back and then just use your speed. Just did a nice job of reading the quarterback. Here's Smith Marset from the five yard line. 
Smith Marset reversing his field. He's got a lot of green in front of him, and he's got the edge. Smith Marset down the sideline. Cannot pull him in, and it's a touchdown for Iowa. Reminiscent of the Wisconsin game just two weeks ago when Nebraska scored, and Aaron Cruikshank took one right back on him. Watch this. So I want you to watch how angles work for de on defense. So you've got to take this, and you've got to get up here. He's got to get as high as he can, and he just couldn't quite get there. Smith March set outran the angle and the player. Makai Sargent back there on first down at the 37. Sargent the carry, Sargent to hold. Makai Sargent down the sideline. Markel Dismuke saves the touchdown as he pulls him out of bounds at the Husker 33. Line adds his help. You can see him come from the middle of the field. You'll watch it on the top side here. Just took the right angle. He's got to get him down, and he does. And a horse collar tackle is yeah. going to be added there on to the no end of this. There is no foul nope. for a horse collar tackle. Good That's game it. so far. 14-14. Offenses look great. Not a lot of D going on. As SC sends it away, Smith Marset inside the five. Hops through the hole. Watch out. He can fly. Smith Marset down the sideline. See you later. Touchdown, Hawkeyes. 98 yards. Well, it's going to be Jaden Williams, number 14, that has really the only shot at Smith Marset. Watch 14 right here. There's the shot. He misses the tackle. Great little hurdle. And then you see the speed. Amir Smith Marset burning down the left side. Stanley. Timing pattern. Smith Marset caught over the shoulder and out of bounds inside the USC 20. All night long. Nobody for the Trojans have been able to run with Amir Smith Marset. His speed has been overwhelming. Another beautiful throw from Nate Stanley. He again is playing his best game, potentially of his career. I haven't seen Keith Duncan, and he didn't get a chance to kick his three field goals and set the all-time FBS record for field goals in a season interception. And it's intercepted. Neiman, touchdown, Hawkeyes. On the coaching staff, Jay Neiman is the assistant defensive line coach here for Iowa, and he watches his son Nick in the Holiday Bowl read the eyes perfectly, get the pick, and gets all the way into the end zone. Pick six for Nick Neiman, the junior from Sycamore, Illinois.